So it's not like an exhibition, it's more about experience that it's kind of fiat, uh, you can, uh, the first piece is why people can fly, it's staying outside, it's 10 meters, uh, human body with balls, and, uh, but it can, it can fly as all humans can fly, as me I can fly because of technical problem and because of uh, soul problem, I have something that care me and don't allow me to go to fly. And uh, it's seven scenes, and the eighth ball is evolution because it's time to take care about it very early time. And the second act is uh, of this experience. You will follow through the tunnel of apocalypse, and you will see four horsemen of apocalypse with the new names. Uh, the first is uh, overpopulation as the main problem of the planet at the moment. The second is misinformation as the main weapon that uh, using now that everybody is taking part in uh, propaganda and misinformation they are reading the internet etc so it is the war we are all taking part in it the third is um, consuming and the fourth is like uh, the reason of final death is uh, pollution and uh, what's happening after pollution you can see what would be after we live so Dante will tell us the story of how it looks the inferno with uh, all these vices and uh, they can reflect you so you can see on them and uh, see if you have it sometimes in, in you or not. So for example, if you are smoking, it means that they sometimes you have suicide. Every evening a lot of us has gluttony, uh, a lot of bosses has anger and uh, everybody who like uh, horoscopes, I can say it's Oracle, Oracle is also here, parsimony and waste, uh, surgery, a lot of things. And uh, here is the eye, uh, the eye can, it's like a scale, because from one side it's like a dark side, evil side, but you can walk around and it will change its color and become blue ocean green like more like heavens heaven side and this is the scale you can see and take your place on it and try to move to the good side and the final the final uh, uh, we can walk there uh, there is a betrayal room with a betrayal room uh, this is the ninth circle the last one where when you can take a pen and you can use the wall to uh, leave initials of the person who betray you or you can forgive him or you can write something else so um, I'm going to change walls because from the past I know that it's a lot of people want to send something also draw something somebody who want to forgive his mother somebody wants to forgive his friend somebody don't want to forgive and uh, can write a name like somebody or it's even countries could be written there it's even everything so it's the it's like uh, uh, it's like the place you can leave your promise to yourself and this is uh, what is important that this is very personal so you're wearing headphones so you're talking only to you so you're thinking so it's all this vices they are playing a role for you and you are the only one visitor but uh, they are playing for you